Hi there, I'm Wolf Larson. So, Donald Trump and Kim jogging his own are in a jail cell together. And Donald Trump, he has a big nuclear missile shake. And Kim jogging his own only has a tiny little nuclear missile shank. And so, they're having Donald Trump and Kim Jong-ing Azun, they're having peace negotiations. And in the peace negotiations, the trickster, Donald Trump, tricks Kim Jong-ing Azun into throwing away his nuclear missile shank. So now, Donald Trump has this big nuclear missile shank, and Kim Jong Un is own. He doesn't have a nuclear missile shank. So, Donald Trump, he cuts Kim Jong Un is own into little pieces, and then Donald Trump <coughs> eats up Kim Jong Un is own. And then, Donald Trump. Donald Trump goes to the toilet and then he goes to the toilet and he shits Kim Jong-ing his own into the toilet. <coughs> An hour later, Kim Jong-ing his own crawls out of a toilet in North Korea. That's right. Kim Jong-ing his own crawls out of a toilet in North Korea. And now, Kim Jong in his own, he's real mad. So Kim Jong in his own, he's like, man, Donald Trump, he tricked me and he cut me up and eat me, and and and, and I'm, now I'm mad. So Kim Jong in his own decides to invade South Korea. And now, the general uh, of the North America, of the American base in Seoul, the general. He has all the troops get together at the base. And he's now, the general, he's addressing the troops at the base, right? And the general says to all the American soldiers there at the army base in Seoul, in South Korea, the, the, the general, the American general, he said, Men, the hour has come. And now, North Korea's invading. And now we're all going to be heroes and die. And the soldiers think about this for a minute. All gonna be heroes and die. So then all of a sudden, the guns of all the soldiers suddenly misfire. And the general, he falls down dead. Oops. So now, Kim Jong-ing Izun, Kim Jong-ing Izun, he is parading through Seoul, you know. He's invading Korea, and Kim Jong Il Un. He's parading through Seoul, and the American soldiers, right? They're hanging out in front of the base, and they're like, "Hey!" The American soldiers are like, "Hey, uh, without, uh Kim Jong Il Un, can we talk to you?" So Kim Jong Il Un come over, and Kim Jong Il Un is like, "Hey, what, what you want?" You know, and the soldiers are like, "Hey, man, look, let's make a deal, man." And Kim Jong Il Jong Il Un is like, "What's the deal?" And the soldiers are like, look, we got these pretty boys over here. And we got this whiskey and we got beer, man. We got, we got pallets and pallets of beer and whiskey. And, and take a look at the pretty boys, you know, they're real pretty. So Kim Jong in his own, he's like, well, what you guys want in return? And the soldiers are like, man, we just want blue collar union jobs, you know, with good benefits. And, and maybe, you know, if, if you let us meet Korean women and, and marry, you know, some nice Korean ladies, you know. So Kim Jong in his own, he said, well, well, why don't you let me try out one of the pretty boys? So, so they call over one of the pretty boys, and the pretty boy, you know, he gets on his knees, you know, and, 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 and <coughs> so and Kim Jong in his own, you know, he unzips and everything, and, 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 the, and, the, and the pretty boy, he's showing Kim Jong in his own, his, his oral skills, right? Oh, 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 and man, that pretty boy, his oral skills are as good as any politician in Washington. I mean, I mean that 
that pretty boy, he's getting into it. Oh, and, and Kim Jong and his owner's like, oh, man, this is like the best blowjob I've ever had, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And, and then, so then, Kim Jong and his own, you know, he ejaculates Stalinism. You know, he ejaculates Stalinism into the pretty boy's mouth. And the pretty boy's pretty boy, he swallows up all the Stalinism, you know, and he's licking up all the Stalinism at the corner of his lips and stuff. And, and Kim Jong and his own is like, yeah, man, you got yourself a deal. So then, so then like, uh, you know, so then now all Korea is being run by Kim Jong and his own, right? But the problem is, the problem becomes that Kim Jong and his own spend so much time, you know, drinking and, and getting the oral skills of the pretty boys and stuff, that Kim Jong and his own forgets to administer the country. But that's when Trotskyist sex robots, that's right, Trotskyist sex robots parachute out of the sky. And the, parent, and the Trotskyist sex robots, they do a great job of administering the country, you know. There's a planned economy, and everybody's got a blue-collar union job, you know, and they're building affordable housing, and everybody's got good pension, and good medical, and, and everybody lives happily ever after. The end. Well, I hope you've enjoyed uh, tonight's uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. Hey, um, besides being a comedy guy kind of guy, I'm also a writer. Oh, this is my book. One of my books on Amazon.com. Um, it, it makes about as much sense as the stories I tell you. But, uh, hey, it, it's, um, yeah. Hey, bye-bye, man. <laughs>